Good morning, technically afternoon now, but uh, it is uh, Tuesday. Welcome to the vlog, May 22nd. Happy birthday, Cannon. Happy 17. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Not all good things last forever, right? It's, it's completely overcast and only about 70 degrees, but still shorts weather. I had the windows down in the car this morning and had them up this afternoon. It was a little more comfortable with them up. But that's okay, because we've had a beautiful past 10 days, and it's supposed to be sunny again tomorrow. And I went over to the bank yesterday, uh, last night, and there was like one little cloud over west. And downtown Hudson is west, a little north, southwest of me. And I got there, and it rained just enough to make little spots, which then collected all the dust from the high school. You can probably see it here on the window better, but it's not that big of a deal, whatever. Wash it later this week. So that kind of pissed me off a little bit, but that's okay. Shit happens, it's all based on how you interpret it, right? Mentioned I got that mulch done over there yesterday, put an hour in, I'll probably do another hour today. She wants me to mix some stuff in where she's gonna plant flowers on this little part that comes out. See, I skipped it. There's that little outdentation, if that's a word, that needs to be done, so I'll do that this afternoon, and I don't think I have much mowing to do. I'm good here, next door isn't bad. Actually, all of them look pretty decent right now, so that's good, we'll have to do those. And if you remember last year, last July, uh, I had a problem with my passenger, with my driver's window in the M5. Every time it would go up and down when it was hot, like 70, 75 plus, it would just make this terrible squeaking noise as it went up and down. I ended up taking it into Jeff's in Canton, and they took the door apart, and they figured that there was something loose in there, or I needed a new motor or a track or something, and it turned out the track was just really dirty that the window goes in. So they cleaned it, lubricated everything, took like 45 minutes, charged me 100 bucks, and fixed it. And now um, that it's been hot here, my passenger window's doing the same thing. So I just talked to Jeff's on the phone. I'm going to go down there Thursday around 2 o'clock, take the car in, I'll wait for it, and let him do the same thing. I'm hoping it's the same thing. I would guess that it would be. Uh, so I'll get that fixed. It's not quite as bad, but it's going to be, so I might as well fix it now before it gets really hot. And I might as well give you a little bit of information on this. Um, June is going to be a very busy, nice, very nice, I'm really looking forward to it. Nice month, I'm gonna be busy, and as you know, I've been waiting until school's out to get my wheel fixed, because this there's a tiny little dent on the inside lip, little uh, dent in the, in the rim and I can't keep air in this tire. I'm putting 20 pounds of air on the tire every couple days. So with the plans in June, and then I've got 702 happening in July, um, it's gonna be, I'm gonna drop the wheel off in mid-June and pick it up like in July and, um, and have that fixed. So then like, I'll take the wheel, I'll take the car over and pick the tires up and get the tires on, and then I should be done. But I feel like I've just had constant stuff in progress going on, but that's good. You know, this, this car is five times the car it was when I got it in July of 2010. So making progress and fixing things as they come up. I guess that's the best I can do. Yeah, it's creepy when you get texts like this. I guess I can't show you the phone number and it's not all there. I saw you, dot, 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 in your car, dot, 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 with your sunglasses on, dot, 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 dot. By the way, I like your pink shirt. And whoever that is, it's not pink. It's called Salmon Heather. Get it right. All right, mom's back from the gas station. I'm gonna run in, head back to school. Two classes left, one of which is a test. Uh, it's totally open note. I don't consider that a test if it's open note. That's just utilizing the skill of reading the notes that you've taken and decoding them a little bit and writing them where they go in the test. And then engineering drawing is gonna be simple, just uh, finishing the uh, house thing in Google SketchUp, which will be no problem. Ew, I remember why I don't come over here to Streetsboro very often. Uh, don't really like it. There is a Chase Bank over there. That's actually closer than Hudson, but screw that noise. I'm not coming over here. It's uh, 245, 68 degrees now. I've actually got the air conditioning on in here, which is weird. I should have windows down, but I don't. Anyways, I just went over to AutoZone. I bought some tire shine down there because I'm almost out of that. And I think I'm going to wash the car now because this is like perfect car washing weather. 68 and cloudy. Because when it's sunny, then it just it dries immediately on the paint and the glass and it looks like crap. So I'm going to go home and do that. I took the oil that I took out of the car last weekend. I took that over to AutoZone and got rid of it. So that's good. So we'll get the car cleaned up, and tonight we're going out to dinner with Kenan's family, place in town for his birthday. So that should be enjoyable. All right, rinsed off. We got some interesting music for car washing. Don't know if anybody knows that song besides Kenan. But uh, meeting some crackers, getting my work done. Now I'm waiting for my soap to fill up. So 
dirt's off. Actually, we can see where some of it collected over here. It's disgusting what comes off this car in just a few days. Look at this. You see it? I think some of that looks like oil. So I cleaned up. Like underneath in there is probably some oil and crap off the road. Taylor came over and washed the Focus. The M5's being vacuumed and we're taking a break. Give it shit. Mm. You gonna chug it? Not right now. Not right now. All right, we'll come back later. Okay. <laughs> the time has come. Yeah, he said we'll right. do it. I'm gonna do it from the side. So let's see what you got. That's gonna be creepy. I know. <clears throat> I had a coat, so. <laughs> That's ridiculous.